Hello, welcome to the City Newsroom. We are coming to you from the forecourt of the Accra Metropolitan Assembly where we are having the annual Back to Your Village Food Festival where we are showcasing food from diverse culture. We are going back to our roots. So there are certain foods that you may have eaten in a long while. But if you come here today, the 30th of March and the 31st of March, you would experience some of these foods that you haven't eaten in a long while. We'll be going around to see some of the food that the vendors have been showcasing. Stay with us on the City Newsroom as we bring you sight and sound from day one of the event. So we are currently in the juice or fruits zone and we'll be speaking to some of the vendors here to find out what they have and how business has been for them so far. We have fresh palm wine, we also have um, sobolo and then we have lamogene. And so let me ask which of the products has seen increase in patronage? Oh. All of our and how has business been so far? It's been great. We are looking forward to have more customers on our stand, and then we are looking forward to give them a, a smacking, licking goodness so they should come to our stand and then enjoy. So, that was one of the vendors, um, or the juice sector, or the drinks, if I may put it, our local drinks that we have. I, I can see you're enjoying your palm wine. Yes, 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 I'm enjoying palm wine. Okay. Well, this is your starter. Yeah. Did you, how long have you been here? I just came. Just came. Yes. Okay, so what, what are you hoping to have? I, I want to eat fufu and ebunebunu with snails and mushroom. Yes. When I finish, I'll eat TZ. Yes. Do you, do you have space for that? Yes, I prepared. Then I'll end it with um, potong poto or apple prensa. Wow. I want to see. Yes. Okay, and you're sure you're going to get all of them because the patronage is really high. Yes, I'm aware. And aware. people are really rushing in for these um, yes. that you have mentioned. I, I've seen that. I've seen that. So I just want to finish this quickly, then I'll go there. I'm still watching the city newsroom, and we just brought you some excerpts from some of the vendors at the Drinks Village. The Back to Your Village Food Festival is still ongoing, and it's highly patronized. But we had a special guest of honor who graced this special occasion here at CTFM and CTTV. The Minister for Chief Tensi and Religious Affairs, Stephen Asamoa Boateng, commended CTFM and CTTV for this initiative. When we talk of employment, employment, the best way to create employment is through the small businesses that you have got. And the food that we have in Ghana, we are, we are very privileged to have a variety of food. Uh, and if you travel outside the country, uh, even to the South African countries, you'll be struggling to find food to eat. But you come to Ghana, maybe Cote d'Ivoire, Togo, but don't forget, they all came together and took it away. Um, so we are proud as a people, and I am happy to be here. Let's now bring you a wrap of day one of activities at the Back to Your Village Food Festival. My colleague Emmanuel Pong has the details. This is the 2024 edition of the Back to Your Village Food Festival happening live at the forecourt of the Accra Metropolitan Assembly. And this year, it happens to be Easter season. And so it is the triple F effect, where the triple F means friends, family, and food. Food is all about culture. It's all about flavors. So here at the forecourt, we have three villages. That is the Khan village, the southern village, and the northern villages. Okay, so I am currently at the Khan village, where I can see for myself display of locally made Khan dishes. And so we'll be interacting with some of the vendors. So what do you have here? We have Fufu, Benkun, Kokonte, a.k.a. Abete. We have abunabunu, uh, akante soup, ochin soup, tilapia, and what have you. So what meats do we have in We have snail, mushrooms, everything inside. The precursor and everything inside. Yeah. Yes. Then we have akante, ochin soup, goat's meat. We have all of them. Okro soup. We have abenkwa. Yes, please. We know it's African month and it's the food bazaar. Any special inspiration, especially with the green green? Uh, yes. You know, we have been eating in our normal days. We eat rice, rice, rice. So for us, we don't normally do the green green. Most people don't know how to prepare it. So for us, as for ANF, we are specializing in abunabunu. So here at North Foods, we have apapansa, and um, so that's it. 
So, apple prancer, we use um, chichwe with palm nut soup, and then you can just eat it alone. You need to have your carb. There's super cool in there. The zamane, the strands, you know, I mean, it's, it's very, very tasty. It's typically of an Akan setup. An Akan setup. Well, you can see it, right? Okay. So we have goat slice soup. So for that one, it's, it's, it's normal. Everybody takes it. But then I have ebunebuno. And when we say ebunebuno, um, you have your engwa. I'm not going to say snails. You have engwa, you have koto, um, you have salmon in there, and quantum rainy womb. So it's green. You know what I'm saying? And it's really, really nice. You can use your super cool, I mean, when you are preparing it, so that you can have that feel of the Akan stuff. Um, how has the patron been so far? Um, actually, today is my first time. I've not been here before. Um, it's my husband who was like, hey, I heard of this city program, so you need to come. So he registered me. And I'm so pleased. I thank him for the opportunity. Um, you're meeting a lot of people, you know, apart from you ad advertising. Um, I think some people would not really get the time to do some of this stuff at home. But then I, I, I think I've had some few people coming from outside. The person was like, it's not like I want to eat them before. I just want to taste their preference. I want to have a feel of it. Away from the Akan village, let's head to the northern village to find what is also available. What, what food do we have here? So we have um, all, uh, almost all the various northern dishes. We have the tubani, we have the tozafi, we have the dawadawa jollof, and then we have the wache also. So, what what's so unique or what's so special soup goes with the tozafi? So, the, the tozafi goes with ayoyo, that is what is uh, more popular. But it can also go with dry okra soup, it can go with asuaka, or some people call it bitter leaf soup. It can also go with bitter soup. Even, you can even eat it with granola soup, or even with normal okra soup. Now let's talk about patronage from um, people that have come in. Um, it's just about some few minutes to two o'clock. How has sales been for you? I think it's been very great. And you can see um, uh, my food is almost running out. So as I'm talking to you, I'm taking some plants in my head. I'm going to get uh, food to come here on time. So as you can see, the place is very, very busy. People are eating, they are enjoying the food. Some of the patrons of day one have been sharing the excitement with me. It's so, 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 so exciting. As you can see, my fufu with goat meat and akranti and I'm tells it all. I'm enjoying from Natch Foods and it's super. I'm inviting all, all those in the house to come. They should come and enjoy. We have variety. If you come to Natch Foods, we have rare wine, we have akranti and wine, we have inkatin wine, abe and In fact, all the local foods are here, so I'm inviting them all to come and enjoy as I'm doing. I think it's a wonderful initiative. Having found myself and my family here on a holiday like this, and the environment is very receptive. Also, per the setup, we are able to have variety. It's nothing static, so it makes it a very nice Day for the festival. For now, I'm doing the northern sector, but then I'll descend. I'll make sure I do the southern last before I leave here. And I, I love northern foods. You see, I'm always in the south. I eat my fufu, my banku, my kenke. But I see this one, especially from the north, it's not always that I have to get them. I have to go to some certain joints before I get them. But since this festival is available, I have to take my favorites. The Back to Your Village Food Festival is made possible by sponsors including Frital, Fortune Rice, Miss Cookie Spices, Pan African Savings and Loans, Everpark, and GB Foods. As we climb us the Heritage Month with the Back to Your Village Food Festival, day one has been fan filled. Day two promises to be more interesting. Reporting for City News. My name is Emmanuel Lapone.